<laughs> incredible. Absolutely incredible turn. Good evening, folks. Welcome to the video. My name is Tommy. Today, we're going to be using a nice shiny Guzzlord, if you can believe that. This is a Blunder Policy set. A Blunder Policy is an insane item because it relies on you missing a move. And betting on failure is never a good strategy, but in this instance, we're going to make it work. And if you guys enjoy this one and you want to see more insane, crazy Pyrotos special sets, feel free to smash that like button and subscribe if you want to see more. That'd be much appreciated. So obviously, Blunder Policy with Dragon Rush. Dragon Rush is 75% accurate with a chance to flinch. So if you can use your substitute, set upon stuff like Ordino or Eldegoss that will basically give you a free sub, you can try and miss and then just keep hitting. So you get your speed boost and then you can try and kill something, get your beast boost and then go from there basically. Quake is good for steel types or you know most notably Agron which a lot of people are using. Heat Crash, you could definitely run Heavy Slam here for fairies. The reason I choose Heat Crash is because I think it covers a lot of stuff that you can surprise your opponent with. So like Ferris Seed's a good example or just grass types in general, you can hit really hard. I also like running this because it covers the two main fairies, or, you know, two of the main fairies, so Rabombi and Whimsicott. You could definitely run Heavy Slam, like I said, or maybe Stone Edge for Rabombi and Charizard, but I'm going to start with that and see how it goes. Nice choice specs Rabombi with the webs. Webs will definitely help this thing out in some scenarios. We have Center Scorch for breaking down walls, so really fat stuff like Aromatis. Definitely not something we want to see with Guzzlord, so this will help. We have Cryogonal just for spinning. Honestly, I'm not even a big fan of the set, but having Rapid Spin is definitely going to help out, especially for stuff like Toxic Spikes. Defensive Court is just going to be Sandaconda, because it has Glare, and Glare is obviously very nice for crippling stuff for the sake of Guzzlord. Get that nice Power Flinch going with Dragon Rush. And obviously Special Defensive, Pivot Lantern. Having some kind of pivot is very useful just to get this thing in safely. These three I may change at some point, we'll see. Maybe stick a Regirock in there or something, but we'll start with that and see how it goes. Let's get on with the games. Alright, so we've not even started yet, but I already decided, you know what, we're going Regirock. Which is definitely good in this scenario here, we got stuff like Charizard and Scyther. Regirock's cool because it still gets Thunder Wave, but you can also do some pretty nice damage with Body Press and Stone Edge. So let's start with that and see what we can do. I would say Center Scorch. I mean, the good thing here is that even though the defensive core is both weak to grass, like we have three resists and a cryogonal, so I think we'll be fine, honestly. So we go Reggie. The aerial aces, that's not a problem. I don't know, I suppose we're just Thunder Wave. Nothing really appreciates it. Do this. And then get these up. Iron Defense. That is not the shit I like. Well, I have Energy Ball. What I'll do is... I guess we go straight to Lantern. And try and get some damage off. I want to say this takes a body press from full, but I don't know because Regirock is a monster. Okay, just about. I I'm not going to mess around with this, I'm just going to scold again. It's annoying because I lose my switch into Togedemaru, or my best switch in, let's say. But whatever, we'll work around it. Let's go for a fat Moonblast. Alright, pretty good. Well, I don't think Regirock has anything to worry about. Take zero from that. Just go rough with the body press. 
Get him out of there. Absolutely insane play here would be going to Guzzlord on the Defog. But I'm not that insane, so we're going to do this. <laughs> I'll just go for knockoff. Hopefully, goes Charizard. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Don't have a good switch into this anymore. But this is way too valuable to waste, so we're going to go Regirock. That slash does a decent amount, I suppose. I'm going to body press. Oh, yeah, she has Scorching Sands. Okay. Unfortunate. Okay. Might be a good time to do this. We go for Dragon Rush first. I mean, this dies like if it switches, so it's whatever. Miss, miss this one. I need it. Yes, it's time. <laughs> now we just hope he doesn't encore. Okay, don't miss again. All right, you only have to miss once, idiot. All right, cool. We're good. Heat crash. Unless he scarfs something, we just heat crash everything, right? What's he gonna do about it? That speed boost is all we needed. I I don't think he scarfed Scyther, and I know he's not scarfed Token Mara. So I think we're good. What an amazing game to start with, ladies and gents. No, his boots. Doesn't matter. Earthquake. Heat crash. So you chump. So I knew heat crash was the right choice. Just covers a lot of stuff, and that's boots as well, so we just heat crash. <laughs> Big guzzles. That's boots as well. Shocking. And then that's boots as well. Literally everything boots except the Reggie Rock. Right? Alright, that's amazing. Good stuff. Another instant classic for Guzzlord. Looking at this matchup. Unless he's like Scarf Jinx, in which case, rip. I'm gonna start Reggie. What, you think I care about Hitman Lee? Think that shit scares me? <laughs> Alright, cool. Let's go B. And what we'll do is we'll go to... I think we have Regirock here. Yeah, Agron comes in, that's cool. Now we go right for the body press. Which is insane damage. Beautiful. You know, I really want to just set up here. I really do. Nah, because it would definitely swap out. There's no way. Well, I'll tell you what. Let's see what his reaction is. We'll go to this. We'll go for the heat crash because it will kill from there. I should have subbed up. I didn't expect that. Insane play, my guy. Hopefully it goes Lantern, because that's a free sub. No, oh, okay, fair enough. So we've got to see if he has Toxic, because a lot of them do. Dragon Pulse, okay, sure. Now we're Toxic. Alright, let's see what we go for me, man. Go cryo. Well, 
four switches out. Okay, yep, yeah, good play. Unfortunately, we're not ancient power on this set. As much as I know you guys wanted to see that. Big Zard comes in. You know what? I'm going to toxic you. I don't care. There's the sunny day. Bruh. Is this going to have Solar Beam? <laughs> He's going to have Solar Beam, isn't he? Ah, right, whatever. I'm not bothered. So he's going to take a load of damage there. He's in range of B. So I think we'll just go for the Specs Moonblast. That's a pretty good idea. Now, I've seen this kill Scythers from Fall before. But that's like a, you know, a boot Scyther with no HP investment. So I don't know, man. I don't know if I'll take that chance. What are my options here? Um, maybe that is my only chance. So it's a roll, I guess. What we'll do is we'll go to Lantern here. I think he's going to U-turn, so I'm not going to pull a double. Okay, she's going to wing beat for some reason. Fair enough. Understandable. Have a nice day. I want Lantern to come in. Or, you know, aggro, and I'll take that. Yep, not a problem. Let's go straight to Guzzles. Okay, I did not expect that. Let's go for a quake here. Big. Alright, I guess we just do the same again then. Get our boost. I, I don't think there's any way Jinx beats us, right? Right? How would that work? Dragon Rush, because it's funny. <laughs> yeah, okay, fine. It's a nasty plot set. Bruh. Okay, I guess we'll go to Center Scorch then. Let's hit with Lee. Him and Lee does not take this. There's no way. It has like 30 defense or something ridiculous. Yeah, I'm not bothered about this. Let's just go for the Leech Life. So I shock. Yeah, it's all good. It's all good, boys. Get him out of there. And then last is this, which has no chance. Get him out of there. Oh, he lives on 1%. That's hilarious. Good stuff. <laughs> There's only one thing for it. I've got a power whip. Excellent, right. Very close one, actually. Go next. Uh, we have a Fungus for some reason. I I'm genuinely curious as to what... I mean, I know it's just going to be like Spore Sludge Bomb, but... Surely you run Chinotic or something. Right? Doesn't make sense to me. I will need Lantern. This thing. Just going to Poison. That's quite a lot of damage. Yeah. I don't think he's banded though. I think he's just, you know, a Raquanid and strong. 
Let me see what he does. Oh, God plays. Absolute God plays. Have you ever seen a play like that? <laughs> we'll pretend that was deliberate. I right, know what. Maybe good cryo here. What an absolutely insane play that was. Now we're just going to freeze dry. Archaeops. I don't know, man. It's Meteor Beam? Is that what people run nowadays? I feel like you wouldn't bother running physical on both of these. That'd be a bit weird. Well... I'll tell you what, I don't like Sense Scorch in this matchup anyway. You turn Flame Body? Nope. Raccoon's in. I mean, we're faster, I might just go for damage, honestly. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. We'll do that. I have no problem with that. Now, do we go B or do we go Guzzlord? I'm kind of feeling the Guzzlord. Right, let's just Dragon Rush get rid of this thing. Quillfish in. Clearly some kind of defensive set. I'm going to go Reggie. T-Waves, that's really funny. Thank you for that. Get some rocks up. Oh, he's torn. Okay. Understandable. Just going to chip him down with helmet. <laughs> Lantern's in, gets... Oh, no. No chip on Lantern. Unfortunate. Let's go to my own. Wait, I'm water absorbed? Wait, <laughs> when did that happen? Okay, I'm not actually supposed to be water absorbed, but I'll take it for this game anyway. Toxic. Because Fungus. Yeah, you're a funny guy. You're a fun guy. Get it? Let's heal that off. Yep. I'm going to try Guzzles. Archaeops. We still don't know what he is. Let's go to Regirock and see what he does. Regirock takes very little from that. That's good. I mean, he should go for Volt Switch, yeah. So we can get our rocks up at least. Clear body this thing. Alright, we'll go Lantern. Now let's see, Scold here. Lantern comes in. Goddamn Fungus. Into Cryo. That does not very much, that's good. Seal that off. Foul play. Okay, fair enough. Spin. And Toxic, yes. <laughs> he has all the moves. Should go for a freeze dry. That does. Not a whole lot. But I think it's okay. Cover up. Lantern here. Right, let's try and go in guzzles here. Okay. 
Sub up. It's Quillfish. I actually don't know if we're quicker, so he'll find out. Well, I guess not. Nice bit of chip. Oh, that's right, he doesn't have poison jab. <laughs> that's pretty funny. Let's go for the D Rush. There's the miss. That's what we needed. It started already. <laughs> so go back to normal there. How much are we doing with Heat Crash? That kills, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's time. It's guzzling time. And then we just, uh, like, Lantern dies to Earthquake. That dies to Dragon Rush, so. Very nice game. Oh lordy, I see the opportunity here. Look at all this stuff that's going to drop to Guzzlord. Apart from Ice Q, obviously. Well then. Crustle's really annoying, but I think we'll just lead Reggie Rock and cripple it. Oh, good. I love that shit. Go straight to Center Scorch. And Leech Life. <laughs> no, it's not weak armor, that's actually good. Yeah, I guess we've got to go Reggie Rock. And hope he's not the infamous Power Herb Solar Beam. Which is an insane set. Right, we we'll should do this. Look at that. That is pathetic, that damage. Now we can body press. I, I would have loved... Jesus Christ. I would have loved rocks, but it's, it's not worth it. I'm going to lose to this now. <laughs> I'm going to lose because I didn't click Stone Edge. I'll tell you what. If he has X Scissor, I'm done. I got nothing. Or, you know, if he's... Maybe if he's adamant, I can get away with it. Hooray! Thank God for that. Uh, this thing... That's whatever. Let's just go to... Center Scorch. Right, what we got for me? Psy Shock, maybe? Oh, he knows. He knows I'm Flame Body. But he's a Sun Team? What? Maybe he was Solar Blade. Oh, that's interesting. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to... Well, I guess we're going for a Bombi. This is where you want Psychic for stuff like this, but I figured webs would come in handy some games. Not that I've really used it so far. Alright, El Bindito's in. Just go Cryo, because it's not really going to do me much good anyway, this game. <laughs> Freeze dry. Oh, yeah, look at that. Nope. Alas. That's okay. Spin that shit away. I, I mean, I'm quite happy just to let this die, honestly. To get some chip off on this. A second freeze. Can you believe it, ladies and gents? Absolutely insane play. <laughs> I'm not going to bother recovering. I don't care, it's not worth it. Like if he goes Ice Q, great, I can poison it. This <laughs> Sorry man. I don't control it. Alright, what's next? 
whatever comes in is getting poisoned. Perfect. Oh dear. Well, actually, it doesn't even matter because I've still got Morbius. See, subs, yep, yeah, whatever. Not a problem. Also, it doesn't even get anything for water types. Yeah, it's like liquidation ice punch or ice go crash. That's basically it. Right, whatever. Vault switch here. There's a, another bit of hacks to, to add to the list. That's good stuff. We'll go guzzles. Lurligan, I'm not too bothered about this. It's Dragon Rush. It's Leech Seed? What? Alright, well, I'll just heat crash this thing then. <laughs> ah, so good. This set is amazing, man, honestly. I'll never use another Guzzlord again. I mean, a different set. Why would I? I got this. See? More hacks. Unfortunately, we have 10 million HP, so Leech Seed does a lot. You know, this guy's going to probably stop playing after this one, because that was, that was a horrible game, hacks-wise. But, you know, I enjoyed it, that's the main thing. Game against Grrt. It's quite tough, actually. Scrafty is, is definitely a problem for Guzzles. So is Intimidate Quillfish. Looks like more of a, a Rabombi game. Hopefully he's not special defensive. Togedemaru. Well, I think what we can do is start with this. Chippy's in. We have knockoff. See if we can flame body in turn one. That's amazing, getting rid of Black Sludge on this. These boots. That is... that's not a defensive set, I don't think. Interesting. Right, Regirock is not all that useful this game, so I don't mind risking it. Let's see if he has Taunt. Right, yes, fine. I mean, this is 100% getting body pressed. <laughs> That's the main thing stopping Guzzlord, so. It's all good. Center Scorch comes in. If he was Hurricane, I would have rage quit. Right, now what? Fire Lash. Yeah, I reckon this is max speed. So I'm not going to stay in here. I'm going to go to... Yeah, not Lantern. Probably... Reggie Rock? Question mark? Yeah, we'll do that. I'll take a shitload. And then we'll just body press immediately. I want to try and get some damage on Sand Slash. Just to this, that's cool. Very nice, very nice. At this point, we sack. Okay, now we can go to this thing. And spin that away. We don't want that nonsense hanging around. Is this lefties? Oh, we don't know what he is. Okay. Center Scorch. A 
God damn this thing. That's a pretty good chunk. Just earthquake here. Bringing in the B on me, I see. Heat crush. There's a little chip. That's good. I'm gonna sub up. I mean, it doesn't really matter because he breaks subs anyway, but we'll try. Dragon Rush here. <laughs> really, really bad move, that is. But the main stop to Center Scorch is gone, that's good. He crash here. I don't know why he brought that back in, he already saw it was quicker. That was a weird one. Right, Sand Slash is Dragon Rush you. Nice. I'm definitely feeling the freeze dry here. Excellent, good. Don't need any investment for that. Chippy's in. Lantern will always switch into this. And I'll just force switch. And from here it's just a center scorch. Clean up, unless he's Hurricane, which would be really annoying. Yeah, I don't care about that. Ah, not bad at all. And then Togedemaru's Scarf, they can't do much. That was a nice game. Let's grab one more. I'm sure I play this guy. I also think it might be one of my followers, Perla, under one of his ults, but I can't remember. <laughs> we shall see. Alright. Tough team, we've got webs, big guzzles, which can run a lot of different sets. Oh, sh I don't have anything for a Raquanid. I really don't. Let's try this. Like, what do I do? Try and Stone Age and hope we live? You know, just about. <laughs> I mean, that's good, but there goes our switch into Hitman Lee. I mean, this would take on Hitman Lee from full. But, not a bad trade, in retrospect. Alright, let's see. I'm trying Thunder Wave. Yep, yeah, okay. Shit, he's White Herb. I'm just gonna fucking lose to this turn one. <laughs> I, t I know what's going to happen. He's going to have Rock Slide or Stone Edge for this and this. CC, CC, CC. I'm going to have absolutely nothing to take this on. <laughs> I know how this goes. I mean, if I was really... Okay, I got lucky. If I was being really careful, I would have switched around to get him some defense drops and then gone to this. But luckily, I... I just have too much luck, and I got away with it. Alright, so here's what we do. We go to... Center Scorch. Colossal. God damn you, Colossal. Bikes, okay. I mean, we can't touch wheezing. I gotta go back to this. Try freeze dry, get some chip off. I need this a little bit lower before we can do anything. God damn it. Now you see. This is why we have Toxic, and hopefully he doesn't kill us with, like, Heat Crash. Oh, no, 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 no. Yes. Saved. Right, I'm doing this for Lantern's sake. Alright, good stuff. 
No, he's flame orb. <laughs> oh shit. Right, we're gonna do this once. This cryogonal set, man, honestly. I, I should definitely keep this. Right, okay, we should freeze dry and see what happens. That looks like a salt vest to me. So I'm actually gonna sack lantern to a I don't know, whatever, knockoff. It's a shame because I I can't really do anything with Guzzlord. There's no way. I guess we go B and try and get some big damage off. But Colossal is like one of the best switch-ins to Robombi. Of all time. Good guzzles. Alright, it's time. We'll go for Dragon Rush. <laughs> Get my boost. I guess we'll sub and hopefully it goes for Willow or something. I don't know. It's time. Wait, this doesn't break subs? I always assumed it did. Oh my god. That seriously doesn't have its subs broken by Weezing? Weezing's not weak. But, okay, sure. Dragon Rush here. Get my boost. There it is. Unfortunately, we have to Dragon Rush this thing. So we're risking the miss. This Earthquake will probably not kill. <laughs> so, yeah, I knew he knew me. <laughs> this is Perla, right? <laughs> incredible. Absolutely incredible turn. <laughs> oh, man. What a highlight. Grassy terrain. Didn't we play this? Let's go B. Morbius. I think we just go right for the bug buzz. I mean, Agron's probably coming in, but we'll see how much it does. Bit of chip. Yes, yeah, that's, that's alright. We go right to the shoal. Now they must know how important this is to their team. So they'll do everything they can to save it. That doesn't really make a big difference on Wishy Washy to be honest. So you turn. Yep, Elder Ghost comes in. Obviously we have Heat Crash now. So I think we just sub. Don't see why not. Oh, it begins. The torture session begins, boys. Let's go. Heat crash. I want to see some big numbers. Yeah, that's why you're on sub. Girls Lord can just... I mean, obviously, it's very vulnerable to status. People will always try and state this thing, but... Because of its typing... You get a lot of free subs. Okay, Agron's in. 
We have the Quake. Just debating whether or not they go back to Thwacky. Okay, that's a good play. It's very good. I guess they would just U-turn into Agron here, right? But that's okay, we'll get some chip off and then come back in later. Yeah, so it goes back to that, that's fine. I don't know why I didn't U-turn, I guess they don't have it. Let's get a bit more chip off. <laughs> I, I just love Girls Law's design, man, it's so ridiculous. Like a disgusting demon from another realm. A bit more Earthquake. Look at that, boys. That's in range. High horsepower. Yep, okay. That's good knowledge. I guess we've got a quake again. I mean, I, I want to sub, but, like... Okay. What do you think is going to happen this turn? Heat crush here. Because apparently it doesn't have U turn. Welp, I guess he has U turn. Well, Gallo takes a decent chunk from this. That's good. So it's already started to dismantle this team. Eh, I can't really go Rotom, that's a bad idea. Let me go B. It's thwacky, interesting. Not a problem though, just this. Bug buzz. It's unfortunate that the Hitman Lee's there with the Grassy Seed. Because obviously an unburdened Hitman Lee is going to be quicker than Blunder Boosted Girls Lord, but alas, this is what we're working with. Oh my god! <laughs> what a monster! This thing is insane. Well, I guess they're going to time out anyway. Oh dear. I'm sorry to hear that. Go next. Powerful team. Yeah, very powerful. I'm going to try Center Scorch to start with. I mean, I don't really know. I mean, Wishy Washy is okay. I just realized I have no ground type. That's, that's a bit of an oversight. Yeah, okay, we'll go wishy washy. I mean, if you're a maniac, you can swap out the Rotom for, like, Emolga. <laughs> that gives you the, the ground immunity and the electric immunity. But I wouldn't recommend it. Turn here, go Scrafter. Let's go Center Scorch. Yeah, that's decent, I suppose. Just gonna fire lash again. Let's 
There's always the chance they go Articuno, but at the end of the day, Agron will switch in every time to Articuno. So it's fine. It, that looks suspiciously speed invested, I'm going to be honest with you. <laughs> okay, okay, wheezing, fine. Let's trick here. I don't need this. This is crafty, okay. I think that's fine. Right, wishy washy to scout. Right, what is Articuno? Articuno is 317. Right, so he is slightly quicker, unfortunately. Rocks go up. Alright, now what do we do? Center Scorch. Which is Power Whip. So unfortunately he is quicker and gets the burn, lol. Right, let's go Wishy Washy first. You know, definitely rest up on this. That's going to Gala, I'm not worried about that. Go right for the heavy slam. Well, that's kind of nice. I like that. How likely is this blunder policy sweep going to happen? I mean, it's not going to happen in this game, honestly. We we'll just do this, that's fine. And now we can... Dragon Rush. <laughs> well, there it is. Get our beast boost. Yeah, maybe we get a couple kills here. Togedemaru, you scuff. Unfortunate. But we still get one more kill. Damn it. Tried so hard and got so far. It's Rocky Helmet, what can you do? Let's defog that. Uh, hopefully he just dies to Shadow Ball. Alright, sweet. The Rotom set worked. Glass Tree? I do not like facing Glastria. Oh, burn, burn it. Actually, I'm kind of debating if I need. No, that's fine. We'll do this.
Amazing stuff, little fish. I'll just get frozen there. Big aggron's in. We just click heavy slam. No reason not to. Oh, good. My favorite. I love that shit. Come on, idiot. Fucking god damn it. Well, we tried. I'm gonna give, yep, yeah, give him a boost as well, why not? <laughs> Literally the whole reason I have an aggro on here. That's terrible. Alright, we'll call it a day there, guys. I actually don't know how much footage I got there, but we'll see when it's all edited together. Hope you all enjoyed this one. Blonde Policy Guzz Lord, insane set, but a lot of fun. Actually, quite useful. And you know, the, the rest of the team held itself pretty well too. I'm pretty happy with how the whole thing did. Leave a like if you enjoyed this, and I'll see you all next time.